how uh, challenging were those conditions tonight? I know both teams are playing in it, but as far as trying to grip the ball, getting comfortable. Uh, yeah, the mound was a little wet, but like it's, it's a part of it. Like you're gonna have nights like this. Um, balls were slick. It was raining. It's gross, cold. Yeah, it, I, it is what it is. But um, we got through it. No matter what happens, this has been a great year for you. And what turned things around for you? Uh, thank you. I uh, appreciate it. Um, I think the the most important thing was just not backing down from anybody that's stepped into the box, no matter what their name was or who they played for or, or anything like that. I said that that's like the biggest difference, I think, other than the stuff. Last year was so bad. Did, did you think uh, things would get better? Uh, yeah, that's the part of the competitor that uh, that's inside me and each and every one of the guys in here, no matter what it is the year before, it's like, okay, how do I get go go and get better from here? It's official you're, uh, you're going to be pitching for uh, Team Israel. How excited are you to, uh, to pitch in the WBC? Super excited. I've um, been playing for their national team for a handful of years previously and then played in the last uh, WBC. And uh, any time I get to represent the country, uh, like it's, it's a really fun experience. Is there a certain takeaway from this season that maybe a learning thing that you want to take into this offseason even even grow more next year? Um, I mean, yes. Uh, I, I would like to. I mean, there, there are some things that I want to sharpen, and and there's like I'm I'm always going to be chasing velocity. I'm always going to be chasing like getting my stuff better and and executing better and and whatnot. So just like just like every other guy, we're we're just trying to ha have our uh, trend upwards.